or so can. Threats against judges have escalated into real harm. I mean, the killing of the son of U.S. District Judge Esther Salas, another man arrested with a knife and a gun last year near the house of Justice Brett Kavanaugh. What do we know about this threat against Judge Chutkin? According to court papers, Jose, uh, Abigail Jo Shry, who's 43 year years old and lives in Alvin, Texas, south of Houston, called the chambers of Judge Chutkin after hours one evening and made this racist threat, uh, called her a stupid slave and the N-word, and then said, we are coming to kill you, essentially. And if Donald Trump is not elected, you will be targeted. And so uh, the Department of Homeland Security took this very seriously, went to pay her a visit. She acknowledged making the threat. She said she didn't intend to act on those threats. But nonetheless, she is now charged. And it emerged in the court proceedings against her that uh, she had been previously arrested four times for making similar kinds of threats. And I think what's notable here, Jose, is that Donald Trump hasn't said a word about this case in condemnation or otherwise as he did not uh, when the FBI shot and killed another one of his supporters who was armed in Utah and had been threatening to assassinate Joe Biden. Uh, and so we're in a climate here where uh, a group of people on the fringes are taking what they see uh, on media and on social media, uh, literally and to heart and becoming very angry. And some of the people that are ginning them up are not doing anything to, uh, to lower the temperature, Jose.